That gun shop was blocked here on Washington Street, but tonight the Newton Zoning Committee voted against an all-out ban against gun stores, saying that zoning laws are a smarter way to manage this issue. 709 Washington Street in Newtonville is the proposed site of a gun store that has ignited a local firestorm. To block the store, the city zoning committee passed a restrictive ordinance earlier this month. This was not willy-nilly. This was really thoughtfully done. We spent a lot of time. But many residents who are opposed to any gun store setting up shop here worry there are loopholes in the ordinance and tonight push for a citywide ban on all gun stores. I think that you have a reasonably good case. The Constitution does not guarantee the right to sell arms. But gun violence prevention activists warned that an all-out ban could backfire legally. Well, a ban might have emotional appeal. It's a bad idea. It creates the potential for the Supreme Court to overturn not just this ban, but restrictive zoning on gun shops. Newton's mayor agreed, telling us in light of the implications of the Second Amendment and the current legal landscape, the opinion of our city's law department after extensive analysis with our state and federal partners and input from advocacy groups, including the Gabby Giffords Law Center to Prevent Gun Violence and Every Town for Gun Safety, is that a complete ban would likely be held unconstitutional by a court of law. And again, the zoning committee tonight voted down that gun store ban by a vote of six to nothing with one abstention, but they did not rule out making that ordinance they've already passed even more restrictive. The would-be gun store owner did not return our calls tonight. We're live in Newton. I'm Mary Saladna, WCVB.